All right, man, we back. Mercy Sports Talk we're in the building. Some reports that the Pistons are interested in free agent to be Jimmy Grant from the Denver Nuggets. Let's talk about it. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. And um, people say, oh, you know, if they get rid of uh, Christian Wood, Jimmy Grant can, can't hold the five spot down. He more of a four and a three. Um, personally, I just think he was a product of playing on a really good team. I don't think you could put him on a team that's rebuilding like the Pistons and he can give you the best that he got. You know what I'm saying? So, to be honest, I think Jeremy Grant, some uh, team that's not established, that's establishing, is going to put him in there and expect him to have this this huge boost. No, sometimes when you play on a good team, when other great players like Jamal Murray and, and Jokic and, you know what I'm saying, Will Barton and other and all them guys, you look good. You know what I'm saying? And he he wasn't consistent enough for me to say that's a big free agent pickup. No. I'm not saying Jeremy Grant a bad player. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just saying for this situation, no. No. You know what I'm saying? Even if you don't bring back Wood and you say well, bringing he don't play the five, and he a four and a three kind of Christian Wood can hold the five spot down. You know, Jeremy Grant, you know, you you I wouldn't even like to play him with Wood, to be honest. I mean you could play him with Wood. You know, that's an athletic front court with Deion Bone Grant, but no. No, I think I think Phoenix would be a good pickup for him. You know what I'm saying? Um, but still in Phoenix, I have my, my my questions about how Phoenix would use him. You know what I'm saying? He got height, he got length, he could shoot. I'm just not sold. I'm not sold where I'm gonna pay him a I'm not paying him ten I'm not paying him more than wood. I'm not paying him ten million. He hasn't showed consistently he can ball out. He has spurts. Just, no. Let the Knicks do something stupid like that. Good player. He can stretch. He can shoot it. I'm not about to pay him no 10, 12, 15 million a year. Hell no. Not a, no way, Jose. Like, he'd be good for, like, the Clippers if they can find a way to sign and trade to get him. He'd be a good piece for them. He'd be a good piece for a team that's on that's on the, on the edge of uh, really, you know, almost making a championship run. You know, I just don't see the Pistons like, you know, I just don't see it being a fit. You know, he can get up and down the court, but I just rather go in a different direction. He can shoot it, he can defend, but it ain't like you, it ain't like he, it ain't like he's best, like he better than when Paul Millsap was at his best or Al Horford or something. He, 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 he be good for Philly. You know what I'm saying? Philly need that guy that can stretch the floor other than Mike Scott. Good fit for Philly. Good fit for the Clippers. You know what I'm saying? Personally, no, I wouldn't. Not in Detroit. I'm not feeling it. Just my opinion on it. Some people may disagree. Some people may agree. You know, I just don't see him spending money on him when I can get somebody cheaper and lesser and, and still get the same results. He ain't showed me this year that he was a breakout star. He showed me every now and again he can get it. The bubble don't count for me because it was no pressure in the bubble. There's no anxiety. There's no animosity. There's no pressure. There's no travel. Good player. You know, he's a complimentary guy. He not a guy you want on a bad team or rebuilding team that's going to go out there and get you 20, 25 points a game. No. He's a guy that's going to compliment Joel Embiid, compliment Kawhi Leonard, compliment LeBron James. You know, Brooklyn, compliment what they do in Brooklyn. You know, in Brooklyn, you got KD, you got Kyrie, you know what I'm saying? You know, you got Jared Allen, or whatever dude name uh, Jared Allen is, and DeAndre Jordan. Now, you can put him next to Jordan. And, and, and Kevin Durant, he can flourish like him. But for the Pistons, I just don't see exactly where he fits in with us at. You know, you could put him next to Wood, or you could put him next to, let's say, um, the kid from uh, Memphis slide down. You could put him next to him, but he's not a long-term fit. To me, he's a starter as a complimentary guy on a really good team. On a rebuilding team, he's not one of those guys I want to plug in. I'm just, just, I just, I'm just not feeling it. I've been watching him since he was in uh, OKC. Athletic, good player, but don't let the, don't let the bubble hype your head up. The bubble is not real basketball; it's rec basketball. Don't think T.J. Warren gonna average 35 points when it get back to, to regular basketball. That's just my opinion on it. You know, don't think you know players you've seen play bad in the bubble. Lewis and Montrez and Kimball Walker, they gonna continue to play bad. Pascal Siakam, the bubble is not real. You know what I'm saying? The bubble is the matrix. When when the when the ball ball pick back up, a lot of guys not gonna struggle mentally with being in the bubble. They're gonna be free and, and back to playing regular basketball. You're gonna see guys flourish and the guys that you've seen bubble in the bubble, 
they're not going to be bubbling no more. So not, I'm not saying I'm not a fan of Jeremy Grant. I don't like to fit with the Pistons. Hopefully I art- articulated it good enough. It's more of something that's abstract, you know. I, I just can't really put my finger on it. I just don't like the fit. But hey, let me know what you guys think. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out if you got business, question, cry, response, your video requests. All my links in the description. Want to make a donation to the channel. Cash app is CJGood313. PayPal link in the description. Appreciate the love, support, man. Y'all keep sharing the video. I'm going to keep putting it down the best way I know how to put it down. Let me know what you think in the comment section. We go.